I think a lot of people want to take on Paige Van Zandt. She's just like hinting that she's she's ready to exit the UFC. Like she's she's ready to leave, and uh, obviously she has some sort of like uh, she wants to do it in some sort of fashion in her fashion. But to be honest, I don't think that's our call. I mean, you, when you have three losses in a row, like I don't think you should really start making demands and to remind people what a superstar you are. Like I don't think that's really the right way to go about, about doing things so yeah i jumped on the Paige van zandt bandwagon like she has like an amazing following from her her dancing uh she's very very good at dancing i think she should definitely stick with that <laughs> but um anyways it sounds like she's ready to make her exit with the ufc and i am jumping on the opportunity because in all honesty i would like to be the one to show her the door <laughs> no no not anymore it's been a while i still get comments that's really funny um yeah i mean if people think it's gonna really bother me and stuff it really doesn't i'm like it's great thanks for still giving attention to it that's awesome like it happens it's a biological incident i definitely do it on purpose but uh no no offers but um i still get people dropping in poo jokes blah 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 whatever if it makes their day great i mean i'm I've, i have other things to focus on and uh, um i mean I, the, it's kind of all weird whenever I, I, you know, I'll make a post about my family and they have to drop those kind of messages. That gets weird, but um, it's not going to ruin my day. They can continue to post it. It helps me stay relevant. Okay, whatever, fine. Like, they're just worried about the wrong things. <laughs> oh, yeah, for sure. I mean, I, of course, I'm not going to call any out names, but especially in the, the, the men's division. Um, yeah, you can tell people like, whoa, like I mean, their whole performance has completely shifted. I've been always, a key, I mean, I've been a, a ripped up little kid ever, I mean, ever since childhood, I've been a really ripped up little kid. So I get a lot of uh, people saying, uh, accusing me of, um, of, of, of doping and all this stuff. Not really like a lot. I mean, I, anyways, drug test me anytime. Um, I'm, I take pride in being a clean athlete. Um, I do like supplementation. I like to take, I like to, um, indulge in aminos and protein powders, um, things that, uh, reduce anti, uh, inflammation, like, uh, curcumin, just like, but everything comes from the performance Institute with me. Um, so again, I, the last, I would, last thing I would ever want to happen. I don't need it. I've gone against girls that were on drugs and I've beaten them. I don't need it. Um, yeah, I'm ready to compete. I, again, I, I informed UFC. My agency has formed UFC. Like, I'm ready to compete. Like, I jumped on this page, Van Zandt, you know, wagon. Like, I think she needs to be off the roster. I'll be happy to show, you know, I'll be, she wants to make an exit. I want to show her the door. Um, I'll be amazed. I'll be so amazed if they accept it. Um, that would be an incredible, um, an incredible like matchup and that's what I would love to happen but um again I trust the process I trust UFC who they want me to go against I will go against I will give them my best um I don't care if it's a superstar or if it's a, um, a person that's just up and coming um doesn't matter to me thank you for this opportunity let me share like my thoughts um I appreciate the being on MMA Digest. Yeah, I'm starting my training camp September 18th in Thailand, and I'm just waiting for the. Right now, we're ne we're negotiating venues and we're negotiating opponents next, um, and I'm just really leaving it to the hands of the fans or the UFC, whoever whoever has leverage. Um, I'm gonna trust it, but I'm gonna be a different fighter out there. It's gonna be a lot more aggressive. It's gonna be violent. It's gonna be about just shutting it down and not leaving not leaving it to the judges.